I want to go over this soda bio tuner. This is a BT7 bio tuner. And there's a couple other unique uses. Actually, the company that sells this doesn't really say much about it because they want to be in trouble for uh, making claims about it. it might help with depression, anxiety, or it can be used as a TENS unit and everything. I'm just going to go over real briefly what this is. First, it's like an electro device. And I did this before. Now these are the clips that come with it. They actually go clip on the earlobes and this frequency will go through the brain, right? It's something you really don't feel. You might feel a little slight, slight tingling sensation over this and this you have to be wet to conduct electricity. Now, how this was actually developed in the beginning, uh, it has six settings, right? If you can see that, one, two, three, four, five, six. Now basically one, two, three are different settings. Four, five, six are a repeat of one, two, three, except on half power. And the reason they do that is because some people have extra sensitivity to uh, the frequency. They might feel too much tingling. So they'll use half power. Now the first original device, the BT5, this is BT7, just had this one frequency, frequency one. Now this was developed by the Russians actually in the 70s for withdrawal symptoms from recovering alcoholics that were generals. You know, the people in Russia were um, <laughs> drinking too much vodka, the generals, and they were trying to get them off the sauce, you know, so they gave them this stuff. And they put these clips on their ears. Now, these basically go and connect with pins. You know, it's just a pin in there. Now to use it as a TENS unit, you can use these pads, these self-sticking pads, and the pins just go in here from this wire, which is just a PS2 connector like on a computer. Now setting one, the original one, was considered deep relaxation. That helps with withdrawal symptoms. Now, they supposedly used this very successfully with heroin addicts and cocaine addicts and everything else. Even helps with withdrawal from smoking, but Smoking is even more addictive than hard drugs, believe it or not, even though it's not as harmful, obviously. But it's more addictive, even, you know. A uh, famous person that used this to get off of heroin was Pete Townsend, I believe it was in 1983. This type of device, one of the original ones. Um, setting 2, which is the same as setting 4, setting 4 being excuse me, setting 5 and 2 are the same. Setting 5 being half the power of setting 2. It's, um, it switches on and off. It's the same as setting one, except it goes on one second, off one second. So some people find that to work better. Now setting three, that to me is the most important. That's the Schumann uh, resonance, the uh, Schumann earth frequency. Now, there's a theory, and I don't think it's much of a theory, but you don't see medical doctors say this. You actually, it's like, um, what do you call it? The um, scientists will say this. Like when you stand barefoot on a beach, you are getting a uh, connection to the earth and it's causing your body to be in balance with the earth electronically. Now what some people have done, and they said this works, you know, this is sort of like getting in a realm of experimentation, but there's a science behind it too. So it's hop in scientists actually said this. They took like these medical pads and uh, if you had a problem with say a knee or an elbow, you connect, you know, wire to this and put the wire to a ground in the earth. And then you're connected to the earth directly. Now one way to use this device is to use it like the Schumann earth frequency. That's setting three. So if you have a problem, say with a knee, and, you know, it's just chronic pain, what you could do is you could take the pads, put them on each side, right? And what you can do, you know, these are self-sticking pads. Turn it on setting three, right? And this is setting three. And the, the orange light doesn't have to be on. You know, if I bring it, well, it, it goes on. Sometimes it doesn't go on if there's not enough conductivity. But the orange light, just to explain this real briefly, it just means it's a test light to make sure the unit's working. But you can use this like a TENS unit. And I would recommend using it as setting three. Now, if you buy this, I think it's like 275 or plus shipping but this is one way it has multiple uses so you can use it for the brain 
you know, for anxiety, trying to get off its drug use or whatever. I don't know, maybe not drug use, but it could be work as a relaxation device. But this is where I think it comes into play. Now, I don't have a problem with my knee or nothing, but let's see if somebody does with the elbow or the knee. You could take these self sticking pads and these pins. You could see they're connected right there. See? It just goes into a pin. So you can modify this device. It actually works as a TENS unit, too. That is super good. So, you know, it's got two functions in one. And normally it doesn't come with these pads, but these pads are very cheap. You can buy them on, Medis on Amazon. I don't know, they're like 15, 20 bucks for a whole pile of them. There's like a bunch of them that come in, and you can use them over and over again. And, uh, but the unit comes with this, the ear clips, and it has an armband you can put on it.